Hi, I'm Grace. I'm one of the fifth years in Bendigo this year as part of the ERC cohort. Um, I grew up in Melbourne uh, and one of the reasons that I chose to go rural is um, I spoke to a friend who wasn't part of ERC but did Bendigo in third year and she said it was the best year of her life and she got a lot of hands-on clinical experience and a great social um, scene and um, she couldn't recommend it more and so what I did was apply to be a rural student um, for the majority of my degree and I haven't regretted it at all. So the way the ERC program works is first and second year is mixed in with all of the metropolitan students in Clayton so we do our lectures and tutorials together. Then for all of third year you're either in Bendigo or Mildura and in fourth year you're in either Bendigo or Mildura for half the year and on a GP placement in a smaller town for the other half of the year. In fifth year you have compulsory um, two metropolitan rotations, um, two rural rotations, an elective and a selective. So uh, coming back in fifth year was part of the program that I signed up for when I started medicine. So I've found the rural program very rewarding academically. Um, I had opportunity to visit every single ward in the Bendigo Hospital, including some of the off-campus um, sites, which meant that I really got to know um, how the hospital ran and lots of different uh, specialty areas, as well as general medicine and general surgery. Um, I found we got a lot of hands-on clinical experience um, become part of the team and felt useful um, as a medical student, which can be rare at times. Um, I also found that with a small group of students, not only is the learning um, a bit better as you feel the responsibility and also um, the privilege of getting a, a lot of teaching, um, you also become very close and our group has basically stuck together over the last three years and I think it's a bit different um, in the metro hospitals where you're really spread out. Um, here we also live together and um, spend a lot of time together so you really get to know your peers and become a very supportive uh, bunch for each other. So I think one of the disadvantages of being part of the rural program is that you feel like you have less access to some of the lectures that go on in Melbourne during the clinical years. Um, even though it is possible to drive down, just sometimes it's just not feasible or affordable. Um, the other side of the story is although we um, don't always attend the lectures in Melbourne, we can stream with video conference or um, no, sorry. And also we do get a lot of teaching here that the Metro students don't get. Um, we, we get quite a few hours of tutorials all through third, fourth year um, and um, probably a lot more one-on-one -on -one contact with some of the co consultants and registrars. Uh, I'm doing my internship in Melbourne. Um, I wouldn't say that being a rural student is a disadvantage for getting a job in Melbourne because during your final year you um, do go to Melbourne hospitals and you can get references there. But um, I actually used one of my references from my GP placement in fourth year, um, who is a GP that I spent six months with um, learning from and um, uh, got to know each other on a personal level as well. So I think that was a real advantage. Um, and also I was really involved in um, a lot of the rural health club activities and um, I think all those kind of things really add to your resume.